This is another villa we have got for sale. Uh, we'll just enter the courtyard first. No, to give you an idea. It is used as a bed and breakfast uh, facility. It's got two separate rooms which are uh, at this moment uh, rented out. So unfortunately we can't uh, show you those, those two uh, rooms. But um, well, you will com be convinced if you see the nice viewings of this house and uh, uh, how it is widely built, how big it is. And uh, well, the, the, the fantastic views on uh, the mountains. You've got 360 degrees. Uh, views from the sea to uh, the mountains. In fact, well, you see uh, the most beautiful parts of Andalusia from the house. This is um, well, a small page show. You know, as you can see, lots of room. <laughs> lots of room. Uh, sea views, mountain views. You can see it all from here. It's a huge plot of ground. Uh, Electricity is connected. You've got everything here. And uh, as I said before, there are business opportunities because of the fact that um, you can rent out the two separated rooms as a bed and breakfast uh, facility. So let's have a look. Before we go inside, let's have a look on the uh, terrace again. As you can see, it's oriented to the south, so you've got sun all year long. Okay, let's just go inside now. very widely built. This house is really uh, constructed based on the Western standards. As you can see, most Spanish houses are very small. They look very big on the outside, but on the inside they are very small. But this house is really big from the outside as well as from the inside. So plenty of room. A living part, a diner part here. The kitchen, well equipped, as you can see. Also uh, based on, uh, on, on, on our Western standards. So if we go in here, there's a small corridor. So inside the corridor, the right hand side, we've got a, um, a bathroom. With the toilet included. Also lots of space, as uh, all uh, rooms in this house. And this is the uh, main sleeping room. So there's a total of three uh, bedrooms, uh, two separated uh, for eventually for bed and breakfast uh, uh, facilities. But uh, well this is the uh, main uh, bedroom. I keep on repeating my own words. Every, ho every part of the house is widely built and uh, based on Western standards. So when you wake up in the morning just imagine this is what you see when you uh, open the door of your uh, bedroom, you just enter the garden, you've got the nice views on uh, the mountains and the sea. When we go up here, there's a small stairs <coughs> from one of the uh, terraces to uh, the garden part. And I think the uh, images speak for themselves. It's a little, uh, small terrace here. Here is another terrace. As I said, the uh, images speak for themselves. The house, the villa, is located in a small urbanization that consists of seven houses, seven villas. And this is uh, the swimming pool which is uh, shared with the other uh, neighbors. And as you can see the neighbors are not very close to uh, the house. But well, it's always, have, uh, it's always nice to have uh, neighbors around. Look at the garden. It doesn't need... Um, a lot of maintenance, by the way. This garden was designed in order to uh, make maintenance as few as possible. So this is the road to uh, the parking space, the private parking space. There's a small garage facility here. And here you've got a 
good overview of the houses as well as the uh, bed and breakfast uh, facilities on the left hand side so there are two separated rooms for uh, well either bed and breakfast facility possibility or uh, just for your own purposes and on the right hand side now in the middle we can see uh, well the major part I just showed you if you look here you can see the uh, private parking space So again, just summarizing, if you are looking for a hugely built villa with a lot of space and uh, some business opportunities, this could be the ideal uh, solution for you.